All right, so locate the oil filter. It looks something like this. Then locate the oil pan and the drain plug. You're gonna need either a 13, a 14, a 15, 16, 17, 18, sometimes wrench or socket. This one is a 17. Just put it on, break the drain plug loose. And after you get it loose, just uh, finish taking it off. This is for mostly all vehicles. You know, they're all the same. Just locate the oil pan, locate the oil filter. After that, like I said, take the drain plug out. And once it's out, you can go ahead and just let it drain. Definitely make sure you get something to catch up. Don't let it drain on the ground. Replace the drain plug when it's about done. Might want to use gloves. Make sure the drain plug is tight, obviously. And after that, you want to get your filter. It shouldn't be on that tight. You should be able to take it off with your hand. Once that finished draining a little bit, finish taking it off. Grab your new one. Just screw it back on. You know, lefty loosey, righty tighty. Hands are slippery because of the oil. Should dry them off first. But once you get the oil filter screwed on, hand tight. Get you some rags and uh, clean up everything. You know, wipe down the oil filter. You want it clean so that way you can double check and make sure if it's leaking after you start the vehicle. Wipe that down and after that, that's an oil change.